Hey y'all, what's good? It's your boy YSD. I'm back with another video. Um, something's just been really on my mind, and it's cops, the police, the popo, the red and blue, the the people that nobody likes, nobody. And the reason why I'm bringing this up is because I feel like it needed to be addressed. And like I've been watching videos from like CNN. Like, for example, there's this one guy who's just minding his business, and a cop pulled up on him, and and uh, he showed him his ID and everything, the regular person, and and all of a sudden, the, uh, the cop threw the first punch at him, and they got into a physical fight, and then the man got arrested for it and got fined and sentenced. What the fuck is that shit? Like, and then I'll watch another video... It was, they're like four short videos, but all these cops getting instant karma because um, they doing super shit. Like, there's this one cop that was trying to harass this one guy who's picking up trash using this this long pole clipper thing. I forget what it's called. A clipper, a, a garbage clipper in a bucket, and he was picking up trash outside his dorm, and the cop was harassing him for it. Dude pulled up with eight fucking cops just to deal with this one situation. And I just think that this shit is so out of control. People claiming that crimes are being committed. You ever thought about the, the reason that more crimes are being committed? It's because the police are reacting and being disrespectful and being so power hungry that they can't control us. Like, Law enforcement think they're above us and they're not. The only thing they they got to do is arrest your ass when you do something wrong. Even when you do something wrong, you get arrested for it. How fucked up is that? How fucked up is that? Come on now. You could be fucking breathing, playing basketball in the park with your homies. And a, it takes one cop to pull up and fuck all that shit up. One cop. How stupid is that shit? How stupid is... Man, don't even get me started on these fucking people, man. The red and blue, they don't fucking care about us anymore. They're fucking power hungry and corrupt, bro. I used to... I had bad experiences myself. How the police are. For instance, I was just sitting in my house one day and I was having a normal conversation with my dad. Dad asked me to leave the house because things got a little bit heated. That's a different conversation for a different day. But I'll tell you the little bit snippet of it. I said, no, I ain't trying to leave. This is my home. Fucking pulled up with cops and shit, bro. Three cops came in just to deal with my ass, bro. He said, are you going to leave? I said, no. He arrested my ass, bro. He arrested me and took me to a fucking... Center, bro. A juvenile center, bro. For nothing. Like, I don't get it. These cops are so fucking corrupt, bro. It's not even fucking funny anymore. The question is, what are we going to do about it? Something's got to change. We can't keep dealing with this shit no more. We can't. Racism still goes on today because of these damn motherfuckers. I mean, it's fucked up, man. I guarantee you, if I was dark-skinned, I'll be harassed right and left. If I was to walk out on the street, go to a party, go play ball with my homies, I would be harassed right and left no matter where I was at. But I'm white. So, we all got to show some respect for each other, man. Because at the end of the day, racism shouldn't matter, bro. Like, fuck all that shit, bro. It shouldn't fucking matter. Like, because we're all equal as people. We are all living beings. We're all children of God, bro. And these cops, they're disrespecting the Constitution. The main base of our country lives off 
the Constitution. The Constitution is our blood to the body. And our bodies being this country. These cops, they ain't fucking respected that. They're doing everything in their fucking power to turn everything around on us. Like, and if you don't believe me, go to YouTube and type in, uh, I don't know, I'll tell you what, I'll send you some links in the uh, description of below, the, in the description below, to show you what I'm talking about. Show you some videos, some examples of disrespect from fucking cops and the police. Bitch, I wish a police officer would pull up on me, bro. Because I will make an example out of myself. I will sacrifice myself to show you all that this shit is corrupt and stupid. This shit is so fucking... We're getting fed up with this shit, bro. We got to do something. I don't know. This shit is... It's so fucking stupid and... Like, not only me, but my brother's been dealing with the cops, bro. Like, my brother, he doesn't even live where I'm at. And every time he shows up where I'm at, he literally gotta hide in the shadows. Just to make sure he, he's not looked at. Because if somebody looks at him the wrong way, it's like, Oh, 911, what's your emergency? Hey, a drug dealer's in da-da-da-da-da. We need you to come arrest his ass. Or, hey, 911, what's your emergency? Uh, come get this man. I feel like he's threatening me. Please be showing up at your door. And it's game over. And then watch what they do from there. Watch what they do from there. So, man... It Man, we need God in this, bro. I'm just praying. I pray for everybody that's being harassed by the cops right now. Because the cops are so, so fucking corrupt. The criminal justice system is corrupt right now, bro. And I'm praying for everybody who's struggling through a hard time right now. With the fucking police and the courts and shit like that, bro. Because I've been through it before, bro. This shit is not to play around with. These people think that they're higher than us, but they're not, bro. At the end of the day, they're just people with a fucking badge, a gun, a suit, and a fucking black and white car. That's it. I don't give a fuck what none of y'all talking about. That's, that's all they do. That's all they are. Because at the end of the day... Really, what they are is disrespectful. They don't respect the Constitution. They don't respect the country. They don't respect themselves, bro. Know what they're doing is wrong. And they do it anyways. Like, what, what will it take for this country to get better? What will it take for us to end racism? What will us take what will it take for us to stop harassment getting harassed by the cops and shit, bro? This is so stupid. It's been going on for years, bro. This shit's gotta stop somewhere, bro. It's fucking 2024 and this shit's on the rise. Like, this shit's gotta stop, bro. I'm sorry, y'all. I'm, I'm just, like, literally, I'll be shedding tears, bro, to watching videos of people who are getting harassed by the cops because they do nothing wrong. Nothing wrong. And they still get in trouble for that shit. That's how fucked up this country is, bro. So, what we all need to do... Just take a moment, pray, ask God to intervene, ask God to say, hey, stop this corruption. Stop the engagement of evil, deliver us from evil, and to bring out the good in this country. That's what we need to do. So, that's really all I got to say, guys, but... 
this is a non-stop situation that I feel like will have no end to it at all. It will probably get worse in the future. But one of the things I called on upon is that people commit more crimes because the people, because the police react to other crimes and they go overboard with it. So, I don't know, that's my opinion. Everybody's got their opinion about the police, the justice system, all that shit. But, if y'all agree with what I'm saying here, please like and comment, support my channel, bro. Support peace, love, and positivity, bro. Because that's what I'm about. My shit ain't just about rapping and shit, bro. So, like, comment, subscribe, share with your friends and family, bro. Share with them. Share on the message. And pray for everybody in need. Don't forget that, too. Pray for everybody in need. This is YSD. And I'm saying, God needs to intervene. So, thank you all for watching this video. I appreciate y'all being with me and watching this video too, even though I said that. And come on, let's make a better, let's make a better uh, future for the next generation and so on. You know what I'm saying? All right. Thank you all for watching this video. I appreciate it. New music coming out soon. I'm about to release a new album called Fuck the Cops. So if you all want to check that out soon, it'll be on YouTube. Until then, peace out.